All right, the final, the final, the final song. Final, final. How many people know what a small town is? Two people. You guys are all from Bismarck, aren't you? Jesus. Who? Tabor, South Dakota. Eight people. This is where we start the countdown. Who can get to the lowest, right? Anybody? Eight? Class of eight. Can anyone beat a class of eight? Nobody? You win. Audio engineer wins today. So back in the day, in a different band, whose sole purpose was to write one song every Thursday night for two months. And the songs never really went anywhere, but we just wanted to try and do it. And this is that song, and it started because my buddy's stepdad was out on the road working, and they got into a, the pissing contest of who had the smallest town? Who comes from the smallest town? And my buddy's stepdad, Bill, he never bothered saying how many people were in the town. He just said, we're so small, we don't have McDonald's. And everybody that he worked with was like, what the fuck, is, huh? No McDonald's? How are you going to not have a McDonald's? Like, they don't believe that a town can be small enough for that. There are people out there that think that. So, uh-huh. We aren't at, there's a McDonald's in there, though. You just didn't see it. It's tucked back behind the lumber shot. <laughs> he drove right past it. It's a bad location, admittedly. There's a willow in front of the golden arches, and it. Everybody check when you go back into town. <laughs> Everybody's going where's the McDonald's, Animus? Gosh, dang it. So this one's called We Ain't Got No McDonald's, and it's about small town life. And this is going to be the last one for me. And then I'm going to go run and play with the other wild animals. Just last week, just the other day, I got a little bored, had some hell to pay. It wasn't but one thing on my mind. Got up in my SUV, took a ride on South 83, went down to Hazleton to the dim bar lights. Walked on into Zero Grins, a dog barked in the distance, and somebody burned me with a cigar. Well, I sat down and said, hey, you clowns, I don't mind all them frowns, but what'd you do with all that drink and food? They said, we ain't got no McDonald's, just a cafe down the street. Well, you uh, can't get a Big Mac or McNuggets or snack wrap, just last week's roast beef. One, two, what did they do but point to a picture of a car or two right next to the badge of the county cop. He said, hey, Rev, what's that again? I heard you in trouble. Come back this way, and you need to go back from where you came. No way, that's a lie. I said of that guy before I punched his face and poked him in the eye, but he was ready, and we both threw down. Buck a mule bar shouted and clapped at the new entertainment that had fallen in his lap. Even old Kevin got in on all the fun. Kevin's legs moved in a dance of sorts where his feet moved different from his other parts and he reached out and kicked old Officer Bill in the ass. And he screamed, my name's Kevin and I'll tell you son, this right here's cause I owe you one ever since you saw my dog all them years ago. But well, some of us ran from the truck outside, headed north on one wild ride, stopped the mop and went on drinks, ran low. In the bloody bucket was the legend of a man stood five foot eight with a big dumb grin and he challenged us right there to a game of pool. And then he said, we ain't got no McDonald's, just a cafe down the street. Well, yeah, I can't get a Big Mac or a McNuggets or a snack wrap, just last week's roast beef.
He said, I'm the mayor of this here town, and I can prove it, because he served the crown, and he challenged us to a game for vehicle titles. Well, the crowd all laughed because the mayor's ride was a six-speed lawnmower parked outside, so we said thanks, nope, went on our way. The next day back in Hazleton, there was an awful lot of commotion and the big damn parade moving to the small downtown. I sat for the minute on the grass with some folks, told a few old time and jokes, and asked what the fuck is going on around here anyway. They said it's a centennial, don't you know? 100-year party making this town grow. Even for just a day, well, ain't that nice. Why well, I had to agree that they were right. This little town was one hell of a sight. Even Kevin and Bill were back playing cards. Well, that's the beauty of these small towns where they know your name and they see you around. Sometimes the differences fade right away. But don't go thinking it's too modernized with its lack of amenities. It's still a prize, even if you can't get no happy meal. And they still say, we ain't got no McDonald's. Just a cafe down the street. Well, yeah, I can't get a Big Mac or McNuggets or a snack wrap. Just last week's roast beef. Well, we got plumbing and electricity and refined gasoline and two mile amazement. Just last night, they even put up a new street light. But we ain't got no McDonald's. Just a cafe down the street. Well, you yeah, can't get a Big Mac or McNuggets or a snack wrap. Just last week's roast beef. All right, that was Ain't Got No McDonald's. I'm Reverend, and this was a road show. Thanks all for coming out, and I hope that this was a good musical start to the rest of your wild and crazy evening.